Okay, so do you guys want an app where teamwork and management, including chatting, can be taken to the next level? Well guys, let me present to you Rock. Rock is an amazing team management and communication app that can help you guys set up your workflow in a very streamlined and efficient way. If you guys have a startup, a team of content creators, a team of editors where communication is the key, where you guys have to set a lot of deadlines, assign them to different people out there, then this software is totally for you guys. Well, first and foremost, why this software, right? There are other softwares out there, isn't it? There is WhatsApp. Everyone uses WhatsApp. It is free of cost. You can send as many files as you want. Why this software only? Another software that can be used for the same purpose is Slack, right? You all use Slack. Businesses use Slack. But Slack has a lot of difficulties, has a lot of disadvantages to it. Well, that is what I'm going to explain in this video. With that being said, what's up guys? I'm Pixel Sammy. Welcome to this newest video. If you guys are interested in this kind of content, including more on video editing, photography and stuff also, then do make sure to subscribe, comment down below and I'll post more such videos. With that being said, let's get started. Well, in simple terms, Rock is an amazing software available for your web, for your Android, for iOS, etc. And it is amazing for communication. It gets the communication of WhatsApp. It has the Kanban style board of Trello. It has the amazing team management of Slack all combined together in one single package. And the best part is that the free version of this has a lot of value to offer. And of course, if you guys want to go to the better version, you guys can absolutely pay for the higher versions too. But the free version itself is really amazing. We all use WhatsApp, right? So why rock? Well, what's WhatsApp is great for personal communications. WhatsApp is great for one-on-one -on -one communication with your close family members, close friends, acquaintances, etc. However, when it comes to project management, when it comes to business, when it comes to any kind of work-related stuff, if you are chatting and doing all those stuff inside of WhatsApp, it is totally disorganized. Why is that? Say, for example, you are just setting a message saying that I'm going to give you this task which you need to complete by this and then again you are going to give another task to someone else who is in the same group and then at the end of the day it is going to be totally disorganized and it is going to create a lot of miscommunication between your team you don't want that right that is what rock is for inside the rock interface you guys can create one is to one space for creating and talking to people personally otherwise you can create groups which is also similar to whatsapp however inside of groups or inside of the one-on-one -on -one conversations there is a concept of the kanban style board which is amazing for team management for example you are assigning this task to this person and then this will be automatically there in the to-do list kanban board is basically a to-do list kind of a management thing where everything is listed in a very orderly fashion which is extremely viable, extremely good, extremely organized especially if you have a team which has a lot of different tasks and on that you can set different deadlines they can get notifications in their phone that the deadline is coming soon they have to get this done and the owner of the task can also get the notification that this task is done by him so make sure to check it out make sure to check out the final result so again inside this Kanban style board you can chat with your teammates do all the necessary revisions if you guys want to of course in the main interface altogether you guys can chat with your teammates so you guys can get in the same function of whatsapp with a totally different level of organization that is what rock is for so that is amazing isn't it if you are given task to people and it is listed separately you don't have to start the message in whatsapp you don't have to do all those things just you know do make a to-do list make and create a task and that is it. All of it is already recorded separately. You guys can separate things in tags, you can separate things by countries, you can separate things by people. The organization is so smooth that you can actually just click on any people and see all the tasks given to them or someone else or assign them by something like a group, say for example marketing, say for example blogging. There can be so many things, the possibilities are just endless. Not to mention Rock has direct integration with Google Drive, Zoom, etc. So if you want to create a meeting in Zoom, directly do it inside of this app or if you guys want to upload a file from google drive it has a direct integration so you guys don't have to do anything else just choose google drive choose the file upload it there you guys don't have to go to the google drive app separately copy the link and those messy things no you guys don't have to do that rock is doing that for you with a direct integration so the next question which a lot of you can ask me is that why sammy are we not using slack slack is amazing for the same things isn't it 
Well, I would say that yeah, Slack is a great software and no offense to Slack in any way, it is a great software and if I didn't know about Rock in the first place, I would have been using Slack for my team management itself. However, Rock has unlimited messages, which in a messaging tool should be the first and foremost free stuff anyone should get. Unlimited messages, come on. It is something everyone should just get. Messenger, Instagram, WhatsApp, any software messaging tool out there has the same functionality, but it has unlimited test messages. Slack, on the other hand, allows only the latest 10,000 messages. 10,000 might seem a lot, but when it is a very big company, when it is a very big, say for example, brand, then 10,000 messages in a very big group of team is not really a big number. In Slack, you guys probably have to go to the higher version and pay a subscription for it. However, for Rock, unlimited messages is there. You can create as many spaces as you want. So all the functionalities are more or less unlimited in the free pack and that is a very sophisticated thing. Now I talked a lot of good things about Rock. However, Positives and negatives are two sides of the same coin. One cannot live without the other. Rock is no different. It has some negative sides too. It has some disadvantages too. But I can assure you that they are trying really hard to make this tool as efficient and as caveat free as possible. And I don't like about Rock is that it has no direct indication with Google Meet or something. So only Zoom is there. Another software is there called Jitsi, but I don't really use it. At this point, I'm just nitpicking. I am like, this is not something which is a uh, total compulsion, you guys can absolutely just schedule any meeting directly off the Google Meet app, not from directly this software. However, Google Meet is something which a lot of people already use and I feel that with Zoom, Google Meet can also be a viable option. Again, this is not a compulsion in any way, just a little bit of search, maybe add it in in the future. So people of Rock, if you guys are seeing this, maybe add it in in the future. So that being said, I hope you guys like this video. Rock is an amazing software. The free version has a ton of things to offer. Also, it is available for iOS, Android, web, etc. So make sure to try it out at least. If you have a team, if you have a startup, if you have a company, if you have a group of content creators, where you just want to chat, share files, you know, share ideas, make and assign tasks to different people, then this is one of the softwares. This is one of the apps which you definitely should try out. At least try it out. So the links are there in the description below. Make sure to try them out. Of course, there are lots of different features of this software which it is impossible to just fill it in in one single video. So make sure to at least try out the free version, see what all the things this software has to offer. So with that being said, if you guys are interested on more such videos, comment down below. Let me know in the comment section what you guys think about this video. And I'm Pixel Sammy. I'll be back with a new video soon. Peace out.